Hey kids, now it's time for the kids message. Let's get ready to see what we can learn from God's word today. Today, we're gonna to be talking about love. There are a lot of ways we can use the word love. We love our cows. I love my dinosaurs. I love to be bugs. I love my daddy. I love to foot. Almost every time we use the word love, we mean it in a different way. We love cotton candy in a different way than we love our parents. We love our parents in a different way than how we love God. Today we're going to talk about what it means to show love to other people. Romans 12, 9 through 16 says this. Your love must be real. Hate what is evil. Hold on to what is good. Love each other like brothers and sisters. Give your brothers and sisters more honor than you want for yourselves. Do not be lazy, but work hard. Serve the Lord with all your heart. Be joyful because you have hope. Be patient when co troubles come. Pray at all times. Share with God's people who need help. Bring strangers and need into your homes. Wish good for those who do bad things to you. Wish them well and do not curse them. Be happy with those who are happy. Be sad with those who are sad. Live together in peace with each other. Do not be proud, but make friends with those who seem unimportant. Do not think how smart you are. The type of love that Paul talks about here is how to love and act towards others. This type of love is unconditional love. That means to show love to others no matter what they do or who they are. It means that before we ever see someone, we have decided that we're going to show love to them no matter what. When it comes to showing love to others, we often think certain thoughts. We may think if they deserve to be shown love. Ooh, can I have a cookie? No, you're mean to me yesterday. Oh, mom! We may think something like, do I really want to show love right now? Is that what I feel like doing? Okay. And I can't play television. Sorry, I'm busy. Yeah. Hi, Ooh, I can't play television. Hi, Daddy. Hi, but when it comes to showing love, we are to follow Jesus' example. Even though we didn't deserve it, Jesus showed us love. Even though Jesus really didn't want to, he still showed us love by sacrificing himself on the cross. When we look at Jesus' example of love, we know that showing love to others is never about how we feel or if we think someone deserves it. Showing love to others is about being like Jesus. So when we see someone, our first question should always be, what is the best way I can show love to this person right now? But this can be hard. Here it says, even when someone does something against us, we should still show love. So when someone does something to us, you might want to get really angry. I'm going to knock you down, knock you out. <laughs> Instead, we are told to do our best to live in peace with everyone. That means not getting back at others. In fact, we are to still show love to people who do wrong against us. I won't let you again. It won't make me better anyway. So, when it comes to how we act with others, we should act in love, even when it's not easy. We should live peacefully with everyone as much as possible. And we are to look for ways to serve others. Let's pray. God, thank you for making us. Please help us act right when it comes to others. Please help us love others as you do and see others as you do. Help us show love even when we do not want to. Help us become more like Jesus every day. And when we show love to people, please help us also tell them about the story of Jesus and how he saved the world. Amen.